Next was the speed test. For this we did a 30 meter sprint. Uh, we repeated this three times and took the best score, which was 4.8 seconds. And for a girl her age, Rhiannon scored within the average category for that as well. Um, speed in the World Gym Challenge obviously really important because essentially it is a race. Um, so in any activity, speed is going to be quite important and that in definitely includes the running and the biking activities because although they're endurance activities, having a higher level of speed is going to help because you're going to be able to keep that up for a longer time. Um, so that would need training to improve within the World Gym Challenge. Uh, to train this, uh, I'd recommend something like sprint training, where you're going to sprint 60 metres as fast as you can, and then have 5 to 10 minutes rest, just chilling out. Um, and then you're going to repeat that again, and do that maybe 6, 7 times, and just do that maybe once a week, and hopefully you should slowly see your sprint training, uh, your sprint speed increase. So. Um, Next is strength, <coughs> so we did the bench press 1 rep max for this, um, I had to choose between doing the derived 1 rep max or the actual 1 rep max for Rhiannon and I chose to do the actual 1 rep max because I'm aware that she is uh, a rugby player so I thought she'd have a good level of strength um, and she'd be perfectly safe to do so as she's done it before. Um, she scored 0 0.67 of her body weight in this by lifting 45 kilograms and she weighs 67 kilograms. Um, again, strength important in the World Gym Challenge because there's a few weightlifting exercises and although technically they are muscular endurance exercises because there's uh, a high number of reps in them, uh, having that higher level of strength is going to make it a lot easier to be able to lift the weight more times. Um, so that would need improving, really. Um, to train strength, I'd recommend uh, gym training, strength training in the gym, uh, where this is going to be high intensity and a low number of reps. So you want to do one to three reps uh, of a one rep uh, maximum range of 90 to 100 percent, um, and then you want to have a long rest in between your sets as well. So maybe at least two or three minutes before you do your next set. Uh, flexibility, finally. Uh, Rhiannon scored 16 centimetres on the sit and reach, which uh, means she has an excellent level of flexibility. Um, in relation to World Gym Challenge, flexibility is not really that important um, because there's nothing that really tests the flexibility of your joints or muscles. However, if um, Rhiannon wanted to uh, move on from World Gym Challenge and join CrossFit maybe or UltraFit. Uh, a lot of exercises in those things um, are quite testing on your flexibility because there's things like the um, clean and jerk which means you're going to have to have a good level of flexibility in your shoulders but to be able to lift the weight up here. Uh, if Rihanna wanted to progress into CrossFit, a good way to train um, Flexibility would be to do PNF stretching, which is uh, partner assisted. Uh, however, I don't think there's any need for her to do so.